The race for speaker is on. Tuesday morning, Representative Rennie Cushing of Hampton filed papers formalizing a race against House Democratic leader Steve Shirtliff, a matchup anticipated in the wake of a blue wave sweeping Democrats to power in the state legislature. I think I bring passion, I bring some leadership, um, but fundamentally I treat everyone with dignity and respect, and I'm inclusive. Uh, I come from a district that where Democrats are only 30 percent of the voters. Cushing has served seven terms in the House across three decades and is known as a progressive champion of causes like repealing the death penalty and legalizing marijuana. Shirtliff, a Vietnam veteran and retired law enforcement officer, has represented Pennacook since 2004, leading the Democratic caucus for the last six years. Well, I don't know how uh, Rennie would be as a leader. You know, Rennie's a friend and always will be. Um, but I think the caucus knows my style and how I've led over these uh, years uh, in the minority, and those things won't change. This race follows the traditional Democratic Party fault line of progressive versus moderate. While both are pledging to honor House traditions of even-handed leadership with the gavel, it's Cushing who's taking the harder line on dealing with Republican Governor Chris Sununu. I want to be a leader to make sure that the House does not get marginalized in its negotiations with a co-equal branch of government. A lot of the bills, I'm sure we can work with the governor and reach common ground, but uh, uh, he's talking about bringing the voucher bill back, and that's something uh, the Democrats just won't vote for. The new House Democratic Caucus will gather on Thursday to vote for Speaker with the formal election on December 5th. In Concord, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.